sounds like quite a lot of support for Danny Hodge. Some last minute uh, instructions from the referee. <coughs> so, Sledge announced uh, Dominic Hamilton is having had a uh, fight before, so this isn't his pro debut. I think Danny Hodge won't be phased at all by. Uh, by fighting him when he spars with the likes of uh, Kurt Warburton, he's got some decent lightweights there. Well, he's took down quite quickly, he reversed, nice scramble, and he's. Uh <laughs> and Danny gets the takedown. We've got um, Dominic looking for a leg lock there. And he looks quite close. And he needs to be spinning. Then he needs to be spinning to get out of this and climbing up. I think he's... His leg's still in there. It's hard to see from this angle, but it looks like he's uh, he's got his weight over the top and got control. Looking for an Achilles lock. It's going to be very difficult to get it from that position, I think. Yeah, he's... Um, He's pretty much out of there, he's in control now. Uh, although his leg's still trapped, Danny's now in top position. It's a matter of time, he needs to let some shots go and just uh, wait for that leg to get clear. It's still only body shots on the ground in the semi-pro. It's not until the pro rules fights come in that there's headshots on the ground. He's got an over under, over under control from top position in uh, letting shots go to the body. I personally think he should uh, give up that leg lock. There's no twisting leg locks in semi-pro, so he can only finish with an Achilles from here or a straight knee bar on the, in the legs. There's no toe holes and no heel hooks. He's now in... Uh, Danny is in top position, half guard. Dominic needs to be looking to uh, regard or look for a sweep here. He looks to be on his back to butterfly guard. Just as Danny was trying to pass the mount, he uh, gave up butterfly guard. Oh, and he's given, he's left his arm in, he's, he's slammed out of it. He needs to get his weight over him, he, he can't be leaving the legs there. Get up kick to the head there. While he's on um, while he's standing, he is up, the fighter on the ground is allowed to kick upwards to the head. Drop back down into half guard. Danny needs to cross face him here and get some distance, let some shots go. He needs to try and work that leg out and pass into side control. And Dominic gets his guard back. And again, Dominic goes for that leg. Takes a few punches for it. Looking for another armbar. He's very actively looking for submissions, but uh, Danny's doing a good job of defending him and working, uh, working his positions. He's now got established side control, looking to work to mount. Dominic looking to boost off the cage. 
it was a little bit close. As Danny's staying quite relaxed in top position. Mount, some good advice coming from the Wolf Slayer corner. Looks very relaxed. He's attacking for an arm. Oh, and he's got it. Oh, very absolutely good. brilliant. Very, very slick submission. Very good. Very relaxed. A nice composed win there for um, Danny, Danny Hodge. And, uh, Came out good of nowhere with that sum good submission. Good opponent very, in Dominic good. as well. That was a good fight. Thank <laughs> you.